So, Mr. Beast just paid for a thousand people to have their vision restored with cataract surgery. Oh. Wow. And considering that all of this took place in the US, where the healthcare system isn't free, you can imagine the amount he paid was an extortionate price. You know what? Here's ten thousand dollars. Make your day even better. So today we're going to be breaking down that cost and looking at how much Jimmy had to pay out of his pocket to cover this medical bill. Now, I know there's quite a bit of controversy about him doing a video like this, and I've got my own opinion, but I'd be really interested to hear yours. So why not let me know your thoughts down below in the comments? But first up, let's have a look at what cataracts are and the surgery he paid for. So you develop a cataract when the lens, a small transparent disc inside your eye, develops cloudy patches. Over time, these patches usually become bigger, causing blurriness, misty vision, and eventually blindness. The crazy thing is, more than half of all Americans aged over 80 either have cataracts or have had cataract surgery, so they are extremely common. In fact, it's the leading cause for age-related visual decline and preventable blindness. And the things that put you at risk are health problems like diabetes, having a family history of cataracts, smoking, drinking too much alcohol, medications, and a long-term exposure to the sun. Also, you can be unlucky enough to be born with congenital cataract, which can delay a child's ability to interact with their surrounding environment. So, what surgery is there to treat it? So basically, the surgery involves removing that cloudy lens that we spoke about earlier, and replacing it with an artificial one. And the benefits of the surgery are that it has an extremely high success rate with restoring your vision. There's my watch, I've never seen it before. Oh. It takes about 15 minutes, and it has probably one of the most successful therapeutic outcomes compared to other surgeries that are out there. Oh my god, okay. I see okay. everybody. The only downside is that it can take between two to six weeks to fully recover from the surgery. So how much does it cost? Now based on a Forbes article from January of 2023, the average cost for cataract surgery is anywhere between three and a half thousand dollars and seven thousand dollars per eye. And factors that might affect that surgery are the type of lens that's used, where you live, where you get the surgery, and any overhead costs that the surgeon chooses to charge you. So let's say Jimmy spared no costs here and he went for the premium plan. You'd be looking at $7,000 per eye, that's $14,000 per patient, times by 1,000 patients, and that's $14 million. But let's say you don't have Uncle Jimmy out there looking after you. What are your options? Well, there is Medicare out there, and they say they will cover up to 80% of the costs, leaving patients to cover the remaining 20. But that's only if you're eligible for Medicare, which seems pretty complicated to figure out. Now, what if you're not eligible for Medicare? Also, we've got to consider that the poverty rate as of late 2022 was at 11%, with those in the lowest socioeconomic group suffering from the most health deprivation compared to the rest of the population. So what can those people do who can't afford cataract surgery? Well, there isn't really much you can do, but prevention is always better than a cure. So if you're partaking in any of those risk factors that we spoke about earlier, such as drinking excessively or smoking, it would really be best for you to try and get in control of those things, to prevent things from getting worse. Now, I'm a doctor in the UK and healthcare and the NHS is completely free. Granted, there are waiting times, like there are with everything, but at least you get the surgery done eventually. Now, I personally believe that surgery to restore your vision should be a human right and should be free for everyone, but I'd be really keen to hear what your opinions are. Now, regarding the controversy about Mr. Beast putting a video out like this, I think as a doctor, he's using his platform to raise the awareness about a very common condition that his audience are likely going to be suffering from. And he's also not just raising awareness, he's doing something practical about it, which I've got to respect. And I just haven't been me for the last 62 years. Now, the cynical side of me says the fact that he's restoring their vision, he's going to have guaranteed at least 1,000 loyal subscribers for the rest of his life. Otherwise, apart from a funny looking thumbnail and an oddly written title, I can't really knock Jimmy. He seems to contribute a lot financially back to his audience and he has a whole channel for charity work, so good on him. But again, let me know your thoughts. I'd be really interested to hear about your opinions. So there's your answer, up to $14 million spent on a single video. Just a little bit more than the budget for this video that I've made today. My summary is good on you Jimmy for doing some charitable work and raising awareness about a common condition, I'll be eager to see what you put out next. Okay guys, I hope you've enjoyed today's video and found it interesting. I'll leave a link to two more videos up here about medical bills in the US. Otherwise guys, thanks for watching.
and I'll catch you in the next one. Thanks.